Hey guys, we have a very special guest today in our Goods Kitchen, a hero of mine, uh, the one and only Anthony Bourdain. Uh, Anthony, thanks for joining us. Cheers. Nice to meet Cheers. you for the first time. Okay, so you've got this awesome new cookbook out called Appetites, and it talks a lot about family and, you know, your daughter, and you never would have imagined 15 years ago you'd be on pancake duty for a bunch of kids. What is that like? I love being on pancake duty now. Wow. After years of really hating brunch, all the bad associations with working brunch shift. I love it now because, uh, you know, my daughter likes it. It's, sure. If I were to look like the coolest dad in the world, I'd just, you know, do the pancake bar for her yeah. at her sleepover party. And uh, everyone's like, wow, Ariane, your, your dad's cool. Yeah, I mean, yeah. my dad doesn't do this. And I'm like, yeah, that's right, bitches. <laughs> I mean, girls. So I'm about to get married and probably, you know, eventually have a kid and everything, and it freaks me out. What, is this normal? Should I be scared? It's a cliche, but it is a, it is the greatest thing that's ever gonna happen. and. B, it really is going to change your life completely. Were you scared? Is this normal? Scared and excited in equal yeah. measure. Uh, well, that's all going to be good. We've got some rapid fire here. What enrages you more, truffle oil or Guy Fieri? Maybe uh, Guy Fieri in a Speedo oiled up with truffle <laughs> oil, coming at me with a menacing look in his eye. Would... Legitimately, you're not. But I think there's a legitimate place in this world for Guy Fieri and what he does. It may not be my favorite show. Whereas truffle oil is just an abomination. Truffles are wonderful. Right. Truffle oil is just not good, and it blows out your palate. Brioche bun for a burger, no good? No, no I good. like brioche. I love brioche. And I love burgers, but, but burgers are, are fat, rich and fat and greasy, and brioche is, is greasy and rich. Yeah. Uh, I, don't, I think the, uh, the ideally uh, potato bun is, uh, is the way to go. Uh, best hangover remedy. Is the hair of the dog real? Uh, no, a thing? I don't think that's. A I thing. don't think so. I think uh, ideally you'd be uh, you'd wake up uh, a couple of aspirin, a nice cold a Coca Cola, yeah, smoke a joint, and then as soon as the nausea and self loathing abates, some spicy Sichuan food, <laughs> and, and you're back to normal. Me. Well, I don't know about normal, but you're not <laughs> you're not gonna hang yourself in the shower. Are you, a, are you a Toronto guy, Vancouver guy, Montreal guy? Have you uh, been to Saskatoon? That's a really no, bring it up. I mean, the whole nation is watching, uh, so you can take sides. It's we all have to have a first and true love, right? Yes. It's, you know, Montreal is my first and of true course. love. Of course. Okay, I love it here. A very hospitable uh, a country. There's a high level of interest and a lot of knowledge of food. Right. Uh, a great mix of, uh, of, of people from different countries who brought their traditions here. You know, you have all the advantages to be a culinary superpower. Awesome. So the book is Appetites. It's a really useful cookbook. Yeah, this is for, for, for real cooks to cook at home for their yeah, yeah. actual families. Any one recipe that stands out from the book that people should look out for? Uh, I think the uh, bude jjigae, the Korean army stew, is useful as a sort of a dorm, dorm food of the future. I, I see your BFF in the book a lot. <laughs> Eric, yes. Eric here. Yeah. You know, you're feeding him spaghetti and whatnot. Um, for the next book, do you think we'll ever get to this stage, you and I? A few more beers. Anything's <laughs> possible, man. Even just like 3,000 Canadian dollars. Will that get me some coverage? Half page. Cheers. Thanks for coming. Thanks. Do you love food? Do you love me? If you said yes to both of these things, you're in luck. And if you said yes to one of these things, shame on you. I'm adorable. Hit subscribe right now for new and exciting recipes, trends, and much more, especially from me.